From the makers of Van Dam and Robot Smiley Face Residential Area comes Elysio. All right, I don't have I don't have anything right now. We're filling up the dam. Uh, we're getting really close. Probably gonna take a handful of hours, eight or ten or so. I'm most likely be doing that off screen. We're we're still chugging along. Last video we saw we got the mega residential area up right here. Still working on the second area. But over here we have an enormous amount of things which are unfortunately bleeding well into <laughs> we were at like one and a half million and now we're at negative 144,000. But that's going to change. It's going to change real fast because we are expanding pretty substantially and uh, those things will catch up. Now there is a immense need for commerce. I think I'm going to actually put commerce here instead of those offices. We have a whole nother residential area to design. I'm really not actually sure what I want to do with this. Kind of want to do something a little different, but at the same time, only so much you can do. So let's uh, let's try to think. Let's try to think of some some neat little fun ideas like put a road. It's usually a good start. Just getting a road down. All right, that's enough. That's enough work and thinking for today. All right, cool. I'm just eyeballing. These are probably right, approximately even. Um, I'm thinking what we're going to do here is do something a little different from what we did on the other side, but in keeping with the craziness. I like to do X's. I don't, I don't know why. I just think they look cool. I think over on this one, we're gonna try something really this is like pretty stupid, which is exactly why we have to do it. We have to see, sometimes you have to challenge what you think is smart by doing something incredibly dumb and seeing if it works. Because, you know, having this many connections, I can already tell you is recipe for disaster. But what if, what if in this crazy world, Doing the dumbest thing you can think of is smart. Probably not. Probably not. That's uh, That only works in the movies. This is probably going to be pretty stupid. But um, it's going to look super cool. All right. So we're going to go with good old triangle designs. Good old triangles. Triangles never fail. I, you know, there's something to be said about keeping it keeping it simple. Like, it'd be better to do it right here, but if I want them all to look the same, it's a lot easier for me to match it up by going as far as possible, even though I am losing out on all of that buildable area. It's going to probably look a lot better if these things are approximately the same in shape and size. Um, something to be said about consistency. But yeah, we're going to we're gonna go... With the Elon Musk X design, you can see that I'm already making great financial decisions. Spending all of my money on a hospital for 1,000 people over on the other side. It's like half a point. Um, we should be able to get that. I'm actually going to... Um, one of my favorite buildings, by the way. Not a building. It's a road. But one of the best roads in the game is... Uh, where the fuck is it? It's these service roads. You're here. I know you are. Oh yeah, it's in um, transportation. So you can do these transportation lanes. So all emergency vehicles can use this, plus buses, plus all that. So if you don't want to create an access point that you know a bunch of people are going to be using because it just gets straight up annoying, you can do stuff like this, and you can have, um, not this dumb, but you can you can have points of access um, that only buses and stuff like that can take, and that's really useful. And we'll definitely do that. I had one over here, but I I deleted it, connecting these two points because I thought it was causing a glitch. But it turns out it was not causing a glitch. So I can add it back in. Um, you could also just have right here but essentially people can get on the highway and then instead of having to go all the way over there buses and stuff can come in on the bottom side just 
that keeps the traffic down. All right, so we've got our X's, and they're beautiful. They're potentially the best, the best roads ever ever made. I don't, uh, I don't think anyone else can replicate the complexity of simple shapes in the fashion that I have. Pretty much the greatest, the greatest designer of all time here. Do not, uh, yeah, do not try this at home, people. This is a, this is a top tier, top tier design. Yeah, you can tell that these are definitely not even, because I have more space here. Than I do there, but they're pretty close. That's not going to stop us. We will not be deterred by grassy lawns. We will go forward, repeating the same shape over and over. Never gets boring. Always, always exciting. Never dull. All right, this is gonna look very nice, though. I guarantee it. Uh, sound like that suit guy. You're gonna like the place you live. Guarantee it. If you don't like it, well, um, I think I think the mass graveyards that I have speak for themselves. We, to to be fair, this is probably the my best ratio of people not dying in a video game relative to the population size. We're at sixty four thousand. Like should have at least several thousand. Dead. And I, I'm not talking about from, like, natural causes. I'm talking about from just gross negligence. This complete lack of giving a shit. And using them to uh, generate money. But at the end of the day, that's what this game's all about. It's not about relaxing. It's about generating massive profits. Alright, so we've got our design done. And it does actually look pretty cool. And the only thing we have to connect are... These. And in the spirit of insanity, I say that we connect them all in the center, too. Just one giant insanity. Yes. You have no idea how happy I am that that fit. Um, most likely, though, let's do that first and then connect roads. So, big roundabout in the middle. <laughs> this is the dumbest design ever. I just I like to mix it up. You really do... You really do learn a lot through experimenting, and I'm not meaning that in a weird way. Um, I'm meaning that like in a literal, literal way. Like you learn what doesn't work by seeing it not work, and you might actually get a good idea about something um, that you wouldn't ne never have seen because you would never do something stupid. So I really, I'm doubling down. Being dumb is smart. Putting that on a t-shirt. Okay. Ah, oh, you piece of shit. Yes. It's beautiful. There's nothing more beautiful than a roundabout that just comes perfectly together. This is gonna be absolute fucking chaos, though. Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. This, this is gonna be an absolute clusterfuck of insanity. I don't know how it's going to work. Just... I just know that it has to. Because <laughs> if it doesn't work... I don't know what I'm going to do. Okay. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Good enough. Yeah, there we go. That's what I should be doing. I should be pulling from the roundabout into the road. See? See, I'm learning. We're, we're all learning. I hope so, at least. Okay. Yeah, okay, that one's good. All right, well, that's good to know, though. It's like, pull from the roundabout into the road. The hard ones. I don't know if I necessarily can do that here. It's a work in process. There we go. Yeah, that was a lot easier than trying to get, get that to a connect. I have a dream of roundabouts 
everywhere. This is a uh, peak. peak gameplay right here. All right, roundabouts are aroundin'. Ooh, ooh, yeah, yeah. At each of these joints, more roundabouts. How could you? How could you ever pass up an opportunity? Do you have more roundabouts? There are. There will be no stop signs in this sector. Killing me. I don't think I can do it from there. There we go. Found it. How many of these damn things did I make? Lord have mercy. Yes. No. It doesn't look good, but it looks good enough. Alright, cool. We have some really poorly designed. <laughs> They got, they got distinction. They've got, they've got flair. Okay. Beautiful. You will make, you will make me lots of money. The most miserable people in the world will live here. It's beautiful. All right, we've got a roundabout nation. And I almost wonder, no, nope, can't fit a roundabout there. But what if we could? I don't think we should. I think that this kind of needs to be what it is. Oh boy. Now we've got to get this all together. And this is an absolute wreck of a, a town. Over here, we're going to have one more elementary school. Because I know we're going to need it. Okay. Then we have to figure out the best method for people. I think this is actually the best spot. Because it has the least amount of connections. And, uh... This is going to be an interesting turn off. And we'll just have it go like that. Anyone who wants to come over here can go that way. Beautiful. All right. And we'll have another one here. And then anyone who wants to leave, they can't. No. Um. Yeah. Anybody who wants to leave, they're going to have to uh, do this. And what we'll do here is we'll turn this into a five lane so that traffic can merge very easily. Beautiful. The greatest, the greatest town in existence. Um, and we can probably make that a little big and then have it narrow. Yeah. And then over here, let's make this big. Um, actually. Yeah. Let's make it big so that people have the capacity to do what they want. Cool. Alright. Uh, and we'll we'll play around with, with stuff as, as we figure things out. So, we know that pretty much all of this is going to be... Oops. All of this is going to be green. Okay. Oops. A little bit, a little bit off the edge there. That's okay. Some commerce down there. All right, and then now we need to think. These the weeds. Okay, yeah, fire guys go down here. It looks like they get the whole damn place from down there. A uh, little bit of a police station here. And we're definitely going to need to connect the emergency services over here because we're missing out on so much benefit from those. So we have all of them here. What I'm thinking is, is we're going to have a special road. Sounds really weird the way that I said that. Ignore the way that I said special road. I don't know why I said it with that emphasis of special. We're going to have an emergency road. It comes out over here. It's a special road. Don't. 
Don't ever mess with my special road. My precious road. Okay, um, right here. Cool. So now emergency vehicles can get between these two points, and that's going to bring... Now you can see that we have... The police are able to get over there. They're able to get over there. And the health services are able to get over there. Um, I'm still going to have these dudes down there because they're chilling. No, um, it's it's good to have redundancies. And we need people to be happy so that they make babies and so that their babies can work in my industries for, for 50 years until they retire if they make it. These are big ifs. Okay. There we go. Okay. Let's put this baby underground. Not not like an actual baby. Referring to... I don't know. I gotta, I gotta come up with some uh, better terminologies all around. Alright. So, we shouldn't, shouldn't have issues now. I connected everything beautiful all right lots to do we need mailboxes we need bus stops we need um just all the basic necessities this is a relatively you know what's interesting though about this design and the problem i have my other design every area has a short path to it when you think about it because uh which means that they're going to get a lot more of the benefits from other buildings so this actually might not be a bad design idea i might need to tweak it you know this is actually potentially good design hmm. and, I'll, and i'll explain that because some of the problems i had with the other designs was that they were so far away from certain points that services couldn't get to them but because these areas are holy shit's tweaking out all right cool so we got a bus stop yeah so like everything's gonna get to everywhere and the best way to see this is with parks Right? So, like, you come over to an area like this, you put a park down, it doesn't hit over here, even though it's right there, because it has to go through this road, over on this road, or it has to go all the way around. Here, on the other hand, I place a park in the center, and it hits every single area. It even hits areas down here. So you're getting a really good spread of uh, services. And I, I'm not generally too excited about Arc placements. I'm mainly doing this just to make them happy enough. So there we go. We got all that down. Much better. And then so that's the difference, right? Same amount of parks, but look at the difference in spread. See what I said, Mitt? I was saying it's just like sometimes stupid is smart. It looks like a stupid idea, but you know, with the roundabout in the middle, it's pretty cool. The only thing that's dumb is uh, this. But realistically I, I could even make this smart by changing up this long ways to go here or there there's lots we could do could also not have any connections to to this just rely on the three connections and remove connections certain places what else you can do let's get some let's get some beautiful commerce up I need money. I don't need it. I want it. I want money. Lots of money. Alright, 56 thou. The shit's going on. There we go. Alright, we've got ourselves a beautiful area for 15,000 Burger Kings to go up now. This is gonna be quite the show quite the show let's do it all right we're about to grow and we got emergency service lines I feel like this is actually a missed opportunity over here that I shall take let's have an off-ramp connected here Okay, so anyone who wants to get out of here has to go this way. And that could cause some pretty substantial issues. Um, not very big. That's a lot of traffic. I have only one way. We'll figure it out. I'm going to wait for the bottlenecks to start occurring, and then I'm going to start thinking. 
This could also be a good spot right here, but it's got more roads. Realistically speaking, the best place would be somewhere more like here. But let's let it build up. It's an immense amount of commerce. Let's see what we are on education. Again, the capacity is 6,000, but not many people are going to school. The university, same thing. Capacity is very high. We're starting to eat into our education, finally. Like, we're starting to, to get people. The only thing I think is that the spread is not good. Got lots of institutions of learning. Should not be this bad. And I'm actually a little surprised I'm not getting more demand for industry. With the rising population, I seem to be getting a lot of retail. Um, a lot of retail, which is kind of pissing me off. Oh shit, I used the wrong one. Silly me. I was like, why am I not kidding people? I hate when I do that and everyone's watching. They just, they know it. Fucking paying attention. Look at jackass. Okay, cool. There we go. The medium houses are gonna go up here next to all of this stuff. The robot. All right. Live in the dream. All right, seems to be working. They don't like the angle, though. You can you can tell they don't like the angle by the way they're slapping up against the side. Let's uh, let's put a curve. There we go. I don't think they're gonna like that angle either, but find out. I like it a little bit better. They're not whizzing around all weird. Perfection. All right. We have a lot of cars. Yeah, we have an enormous amount of cars. So we're going to want a bigger road so that more cars can leave when they have a light. And then that way that more people can get get there. Oops. Yeah, it's a little little slanty, that's okay. How are yeah, how are the it looks like they're handling it? Yeah. Center is here. But what if? I really I really want a roundabout right here. Has to be done. Sometimes you just know. You know what needs to be done. Do this one first. Oh, shit. Invalid shape. How dare you. Hates it. It won't work. Gonna have to use a really weird road here to make it work, I think. I mean, I could always just not have this one connected. It's always an option. I don't like that option, but...
feel like I should get the the guy should be able to get this to work. Damn it. Alright. Now that's actually worse, right? Yeah, we need the biggest one possible. It's weird because it just I don't think it's gonna work. It's just holy shit, I got it to work. <laughs> there we go. Beautiful. It's it's uh it's amazing. Yeah, it's actually doing pretty good. Yeah, whew. This is going to be the problem area right here. Got some hot spots. And it looks like the, the emergency service roads, so you can see taxis and buses take them. It's it's amazing. You definitely have to get get these going between your cities. Just allows your emergency vehicles. That's great. It's amazing because I remember in City Skylights when I had such a problem with getting like the hearse and all that stuff to get the bodies. So having these roads allow... I I think the hearse can take them. I think I don't know. Maybe they can't. I don't know if I've ever seen a hearse actually on one of them. Hmm. Still have garbage piling up there, even with this thing here. Only have one vehicle in use. Ugh. Maybe I need to create a district and then assign it to that district. That might be the ticket. We'll wait though for a bit. We'll wait till we get the, the damn full. Right, I mean, right now we're producing so much electricity, it's kind of absurd. Alright, so the demand for medium housing is very high. Put it down here. Yeah. I like to do the corners where uh, best road access is for the higher ones. Leave the suburbia in the middle. This is in it's kind of interesting. Now, do they have internet? We should definitely start uh, creating districts. Shit, <laughs> fucked it up already. <laughs> All right, we got Elmbrook, District of Elmbrook. So what can we do here? Heavy traffic ban, recycling, heck yeah. Roadside parking, speed bumps, gated community. It keeps anyone who doesn't live here can't come here. Reduces crime. I'm not gonna do that though. Energy consumption awareness, that's a cool one. I don't know if it, it just says that they consume 5% less energy, which is cool. I can ban combustion engines so I can make them all Tesla owners. I don't know how I feel about that. Actually, I do know how I feel about that, but uh, I don't like that at all. What, like, what, what, why can't they all drive Hummers, huh? Where's that option? Hummer only option. Um, yeah. And recycling. Very cool. What's cool is you can see. How many uneducated people you have? So many. So many. <laughs> I like I like the stats in the game. Though. That's one really cool feature. It does look like we we could improve some things, but traffic, high taxes, lack of entertainment. What do you want, gladiator? Get some gladiator arenas here. Um. Not entertained. Alright, let's get a basketball court. There you go. You got one freaking basketball court. Oh, it's a tennis court. Let's see. Sorry. These guys get the basketball court. Kind of actually amazing how happy they are to have that stuff. Um, let's put one over here, too. It's gonna cost me a pretty penny, but I think that I'll make more money. Uh, with, with the leveling of the houses. These houses over here just started. They're level twos. Houses over here, oof, ones. Ah, oh, shit, I forgot mailboxes. Oh, wow, look at that. That spread. 
I actually do like this design. It's very eff efficient. Boom, 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 boom. That was the grid, I guess. The grid's just as efficient. Maybe even more so. Looks like we have enough mail capacity, so I don't need to worry about that. Looks like some of the internet's bleeding over here. Um, yeah, I don't know. They don't seem to have a good amount of internet. I kind of feel like I need to just put one of these over here because... There we go. Need to make sure that they all have what they need to produce goods. Okay. Yeah, the entertainment val- oh wow. Yeah, it looks like the parks actually aren't doing as hot as I thought they were. What do I need, like a bigger one? Yeah, large park. Large city park. Ooh, that's a, that's a nice one. I put it against the middle here. Let's get that in there. See if that helps. Same over here. Oof. This is hard. And I don't think these things are cheap. 8500 a month? Okay, never mind. These are very cheap. I could... Oh, yeah, that's where it's at. Like, the big fields. The pools only work in the one season. Soccer fields work all the time. Football field works better. Oh, boy. Maybe the center of the, the city is where I can step up my game. But um, it looks like putting one down here actually wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, that hit a lot of people. Not ideal. Ferris wheel. Holy shit, the Ferris wheel hits everything. Alright, we're putting a Ferris wheel over here. No, 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 no. What if we put it down here? I'm spending way too much money on this shit. That's alright. Yeah, Ferris wheel down here. That's cool. That hits everybody. We got football and Ferris wheels. That's what we're all about. How much is that going to cost me? Half a million? Okay. I just... That hurt. That hurt too much. Football field? How much are you costing? 30? Half a mil. But look at the tourism. Oh, plus 75% indoor recreation. Alright. We're, we're going to spoil. This is a really nice place to live now. They got a Ferris half a... I think I'm spending more money on my Ferris wheel than I am on water for this city. That's fucking crazy. That doesn't make any sense. 160 that Yeah, I probably could have gotten away with something a little cheaper, huh? Oh, the Grand Hotel? Let's place that right next to the Ferris wheel. Get some tourists in here. Alright. Looks like we're having some corner issues. Where we probably shouldn't have issues. This happens. This happens. Uh, I'm just going to leave them. I'm going to let them figure it out. I'll take care of it later. Um, Damn, dude. Alright. So we have a big old bus. Big old bus guy over here. No, that's Central City Hall. Here's our bus. 25 of 25. Extra garage. Do I have the room? do and I don't. Let's move him. Here we go. Ten more buses. Very good. Get those buses out there. That should do it. All in day's work. Alright. Yeah, these corner houses are always going to be kind of perpetually screwed. Seventy-one thou. Actually, you know what's kind of scaring me is that the education over here might not be that great. Um, I need another elementary school. Yeah, that's one thing I didn't factor in. Elementary schools are kind of need to be centrally located. 
Yikes. The high schools don't seem to sh have to have the same capacities. They seem to be... Holy crap. Only 840? How do I have freaking... I have a capacity of 70... Oh, okay. This is making a lot more sense. Seems like I'm just not putting these colleges in really good spots. Um, two schools down there. That's pretty stupid. Um, multiple universities. University there. College. Elementary school. Elementary school. Elementary school. Elementary school. I have so many. I have a college there. College there. Yeah, it would make sense to um, move one of these bad boys over here. Okay. Let's add another library. All right. We'll put some medium houses over there. Sure, why not? Do the whole damn thing over here. Let's actually do thick commerce right there. Big stores. They're all happy. They just need time to grow. Damn, dude, these bus stops are getting, getting bad. I don't know what to do here. I don't think I, without moving. Well, this is just the central bank. This can be moved. Cool. Let's get some more buses out there. Ten more. That should... De I mean, I just added 20 buses to my city, so hopefully that helps. This is freaking... Gonna cost an arm and a leg. The taxation... I mean, they're saying it's high, but... Every 1%'s like 400,000. I mean, that's pretty crazy. We'll keep it at 10. The office rents are really starting to add up. Services is where it's at. So, we're exporting a lot of electricity. I actually decreased the service fees to kind of increase the quality of life of people. Um, let's do that with water, too. I kind of feel like lowering your services is kind of a good idea. Makes people want to come. Uh, everything's pretty good. Yikes. Oh, man. We got some huge deficits. Well, I think that we can probably solve the grain one. I have a huge area over here for that fact. Um, looks like I can potentially get a little bit more, but that's only 23 tons right there. It's not much. Most likely what I need to do is kind of alter this guy. Get a little bit more of that area. There we go. There we go. 151 tons. And, I mean, we just need to, we need to ramp it up. That's all of that. Oh. Oh, Lord. How did I not freaking know about that? Yeah, 82, 109 tons. Bad. There we go. What was our deficit? Oh shit, I forgot how to get there. Oh my god. 1,902 tons is my deficit. That is an absurd deficit. 
that's like 10 of these bad boys. Oh, what do we got going on here? Okay. Yeah, we're going to find a way to make all this work because to lose out on this, which is 300... 29 tons and get more 346 damn 360 if I move this area yeah okay so we we absolutely Wow. Yeah. Like 400 right there. It's going to be a lot of uh, trucks coming out to this area. We better have an extra pathway for these trucks to immediately get on the highway. Just to make it easier. Yep, not going to happen. Cool. Well, that's a lot. Um, shit. Well, that worked. I fucking placed it the wrong way. Darn it. Okay. Okay. Here's how this is going to work. Because we have to go under the road here. There we go. Shit, did I do highways on this or something? No? go ah fuck yeah, I don't want to do any of that basically just want the road connect right here and Never tell which freaking way this stuff is pointing.
Here we go. What the hell's going on here? Oh, shit. <laughs> oh my god. Can't have nice things. Okay. Yeah, the, the attachment in this game is kind of weird. Like, you have to go down to the level you want, then you have to pop your head up. Items. There we go. Just use the smaller road for now. That should do it. That should be fine. All right, well, that's going to be a huge reduction in a lot of stuff. And then they have a path out onto the highway. Yeah, we're looking good. Damn it. No roundabout. Yes, roundabout. <laughs> Anywhere I could place one. Except there. Alright, yeah, because you see we have a lot of traffic coming here. But that's great that it has a route off. That's not going to go through town. Hopefully that will alleviate a good portion of the deficit we were seeing. I probably should have planned that out a little bit better. You can see the farming is kind of sporadic. Um, we have one lumber camp. We have a handful of other things, but that should reduce quite a bunch of that. And that's great, too, because it in some ways reduces traffic coming in. Ooh, look at the deficit in lumber. That's an easy one to fix. Uh, lumber is abundant. Okay. And you can see the production in an area just by hovering. So that's like 600 there. Oh, that's 600 over here. It's 600 pretty much everywhere, even in the areas that don't have trees. So lumber can realistically be put anywhere. Well, damn. Yeah, 593 per month. Shit. Let's just, uh... Yeah, let's just... Well, maybe not that. I don't know. Maybe. Why not? I mean, we could just make a lumber island if we want. We could do whatever we want. No rules. Okay. Let's do... Some terrain leveling. Oh, shit. Alright. Oh, it's the shipping lane. I was like, what? Now, right now, there's nothing to harvest here, but my hope is that they will actually grow the lumber. It's how it used to work, I think, in Skylines 1. Well, we'll see what happens. So, we got ourselves a little... What the shit do I do over here? Mm, this should be fine. Alright, cool. The boats should be able to sail through that. And we should be able to make... Lots of wood. I don't know if that's going to work. Um, I know the one I have over here works. Produces wood. Mostly poorly educated and uneducated. Open positions 8. They got lots of open positions here. Lack of high skilled. No, well, I mean, there's colleges. People just don't want to go. Alright, cool. Yeah, they're able to go under the bridge. Very nice. Got a lot of furniture and stuff like that coming in. Be nice to see this works. See, that one says producing wood. This one isn't producing shit. Um, I have a crazy idea. Let's put some people next to this. This might not be a good idea. That might get really sick, but... Maybe if we put some people over here? 
no one wants no one wants to work this place it may not work we might have to find already forested areas but it doesn't make sense because it told me what the production capacity was but does it tell you the production capacity for for animals yeah it does it does actually it says you can do it pretty much anywhere all right so i think that my assumption there was not good yeah just but it does change based off of area which is a little odd but yeah it does look like we need to find a place with actual wood okay good to know i'm, I'm gonna keep this here as an experiment to see if it can do it but yeah there's no one working there that leads me to believe that it doesn't work be a good place for all the trash so far the landfill is doing really great yeah we're doing great Good things are happening here. Now, how's the dams? I mean, it's getting there. I can't think of it. I'm going to have to let the game run for like 10 or 12 hours while I stare mindlessly. Okay. Let's get rid of these dead zones. So, this is a dead zone. Because they are... They are an eyesore. I feel like the offices are kind of better suited for certain areas. Maybe here would be a good spot. That way people don't have to drive out. Get there. Industry's really suffering. Holy shit. Yeah, that roundabout was not... Did not have the intended... Uh, Get rid of the roundabouts there. They don't seem to be working well with heavy traffic at all. He's big. What's the deal here? They're all trying to like get around each other weird i think what i need to do is have the off ramp a little earlier hope that doesn't fuck things up make that clean yeah hopefully if i can get people turning earlier they're not gonna zigzag the way they're doing that looks a lot cleaner that's nice yeah this is like craziness right here they're all trying to Trying to finagle their way. Hmm. Think actually what I need to do here. Let's turn this into a highway. I think I have too many too many vehicles. Yeah, the landfill is gonna have to move. That's cool. Screw this landfill. Do a new one. Better one. I not actually even need it with all the facilities we have. Good. Do one extra thing for processing. Let's get some 
people out there. Yeah, we got lots. Three out of 20? Shit, we don't even need it. But, um, might be good to have extra storage. We'll, we'll keep it. I mean, this one's pretty cheap. It's only 110,000. And we're pulling 100,000 positive now. We're doing great. And we, we really need to ramp up certain things, though, like... Medium housing is going to really start taking a hold of this area, I think. Oh, shit. Meant to do that in the other area. That's alright. That's okay. Yikes. Got some reds. It's not bad. It's honestly not as bad as I thought it would be. This is working really well. The taxis and buses and everything else are able to... Yeah, see right here we have ambulance that's taking it. Our taxis. It's pretty awesome, actually. I think I'm going to get some... Uh, crematorium. Over here. Feel like it's time. We have too many dead bodies. There we go. Send out the the hearse. One. Okay, whatever. But yeah, we just got too much going on. No buses. I don't believe that. I think we have way more buses than we need. Oh, wow. This little village grew pretty quick. Yeah, it doesn't look like this is going to work. Definitely need... You definitely need to have the, the wood already there. That was stupid. We'll do something with this later, but... Oh damn, look at those office demands. Let's uh let's do tier two offices here. Very nice. Fuel plant. Whew. Yeah, I wonder what happened if I just uh some high density. Right here. Here we go. Oops. Good enough for me. Medium density, the whole thing. Already is a medium density. What? Alright, medium density for all. Suburbia is gonna be. This is gonna be land of suburbia here now. But look at all of those. This doesn't make sense. I don't think that the hearse. Okay, 15 vehicles in use. Okay, cool. I was like, what's going on? Definitely. I have like three of these going. Holy shit. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of people. We're at 85,000. Pulling 34, 35 FPS right now. Not bad. There's What's crazy is there's zero demand for high resource costs. Hmm. We need to... It kind of feels like I need to focus on resources. Um, and there's not a lot areas except for over here. Full or oil drilling. Oh, crap. I only had the one. 
And I could have had so much more. Oh man, that's a lot of petrol. 200 petrol. Uh, 216. That's a lot. go let's get some specialty buildings in here while we're at it all right where are they here we go chemical plant fuel plant oil refinery yeah we're making an oil refinery for sure place it right here though oh yeah we're going all in on oil what else you got for me yeah, i'm way more Three hundred eighty two tons. Why? Oh, gosh darn it. I always place it backwards when I don't do it right. My road access is on this side. I want to get as much of this as possible. Of course, I built freaking road system right there. You can always delete this stuff, though. It's not a big deal. There. Like 400, almost. There we go. Ton of oil. Oil refinery. This is pretty cool. Graduation chance increase. Empty and available for rent. <laughs> no one wants it. Cool. Fuel plant. Fuel production of all types. Chemicals. Let's put this... Let's put these bad boys, like, over here off of these roads. Then let's upgrade them if we can. Probably should have placed the roads first. Shouldn't be too much traffic on these roads, though, so... I think this will suffice. Yeah, that's great. Wow, these have a lot of room for employees, too. All right. That's what I'm talking about right there. Shit, man. That's road maintenance. Okay. That's going to be over here. Crematorium. Let's find you a new home. Go over here. Then the rest of this, we gotta convert this all to highway. that. We don't even need the other one over there, but we need to upgrade that shit for sure. Oh, man.
There we go. That's a little bit smoother of a connection right there. Firehouse. Go right there. All right. Pathfinder failed. Um. Can I move it? Oh, I guess you're getting deleted. No, that's not working. Um, shit. Okay, so this bus route, and it's cool that you can change the colors of bus routes too. Um, only thing I can do is deactivate it. Um, can't move it. Oh, cool. I was able to delete the whole damn thing. Um, which isn't cool, but uh, it's cool enough. Looks like I still have bus routes, so people are going to be able to get to work. Shit. I deleted this bus route. At a certain point, I might just want to delete everything, but I like what I've basically been doing is having bus routes between residentials to this area. There we go. Okay, cool. We're back in business. That's a lot nicer. A lot cleaner. You don't have the stop and go traffic. Nice. Holy shit. <laughs> Why aren't they... Why aren't they coming off over here? Why are they only so... Oh, it's these people from the other way. Okay. So the bottleneck happens, of course, when you have no open lanes on one side. So the best method here is to actually shrink shrink it that that way people aren't stalling for merging a little bit better flow of traffic yeah you can see it's it's fixing itself but it's still really screwed up uh this is a one way too that also really helps when you have a massive amount of traffic to have to like make sure you have a ton of roads for them that really helps, but you can see that they're just getting bottlenecked. This is a big area. We really need a, a highway running through the, the middle of it. Hmm. I think they're just going to have to live with it for now. Next city. <laughs> next city. There's always a next city. I mean, right now my objective is to see if this mega dam will work. It's either next city or I delete um, parts of the city and remake them, which is also fun. All right, let's do some more offices there. These are great because the rich people can live here and then they don't have to go outside ever. Um, but these do require delivery of goods, but we have big roads to facilitate that. It's pretty dope. I and mean, we're doing well. Got 40 mil, half a mil per 88,000 people. No major, major issues yet. The traffic is above 60% flow. It'd be, it's really hard to get good traffic without an immense amount of pre-planning. And the Traffic seems to be... Whoa, what's going on here? Is it, oh, damn. Why? Why? <laughs> Why are they waiting till then? I wonder if I should actually just get rid of this. Keep that. Yeah, 
It's slowing traffic down too much. Ah, oh, shit. We're getting the problem, though, where people are getting weird. Give one more lane of traffic, and then people can merge on the two lane. It might work. People are pretty quick. Give them one more lane of traffic to merge. There we go. Four way, maybe? Yeah, there. Now they can be in this lane and go left or straight. Oh. Shit, I guess the five lane really makes most sense. I don't know. Doesn't really make a difference, I guess. Nice, 10,000 tourists. There we go. Fuck. The problem is that you just have too many freaking people doing too many stupid things. I'm like, I'm actually really curious to try something a little different. What if you just didn't give them the, the option of merging? What if you just had it like this, right? Like you just have two lanes and you just like one goes this way, the other goes the other way. That way they're not sitting there trying to make up their minds there. They're making up their minds earlier. That works for me. I'll just leave the rows the way they were. I don't know. Just an idea. They don't seem to be able to think. And make them make the decision before they even go that way. This helped a little bit. It definitely helped to split these up, but still having issues. But this seems to have helped traffic getting the hell out of here. It's not even giving them the option. Having them make that decision at the stoplight instead. Ooh, so many freaking U-turns. I like it. It makes sense. The issue I'm having now is traffic getting in is not great. And this is it. I'm wondering if I need to uh, do something a little, a little crazy here. Do a one way. I'll keep the traffic going. Just, I just need to keep the traffic going. They're all trying to make a left turn, that's the problem. See, they can come back over here. Okay, let's let's do something a little even crazier now. Make this a one way. Let's just keep all the traffic flowing in one direction. Oh my god. What a nightmare. Okay. 
road maintenance people need to be somewhere saner, like over here. And all these people are getting back on to go this way to go this way, so I don't understand. Why are they getting off in the first place? Oh man. Traffic doesn't make sense, so they're going here. So they can't go from this side to this side, and that's what's causing this issue. Hmm, so they're coming up through here and then turning around. Okay. Fine. You want to play this? You want to play this game with me? Let's play this game. Test the theory. This is the route they're taking. It's a little wonky, but yeah. If, see if this. So what they're doing is they're going straight. They're going all the way through town. They're coming up here, and then they're taking a left so that they can get up on this highway. So if I can eliminate that here, that's that many cars that are not going to be stuck going through the industrial area, so they can take a left. Seems to be working. And then we have a nice little entry point here. Nice merging. Beautiful. <laughs> it looks so wonky. I'll, I'll clean it up later. That seems to have stopped a bit. I still think having the straightaways here is a really good idea just to keep the flow of traffic coming from all three of these points moving. I don't know how those businesses are still there. Shit. Alright, so they're all trying to get into the right lane. Okay. I think what you need to do is shrink this. That uh, will create separate, obvious separate lanes for the AI to follow. Because you can't go straight if you're in the two right lanes. Um, and everyone's trying to make right-hand turns here. Okay. I got it. I need, sometimes you need to just go a little bit back. There we go. Go. Make obvious distinctions. And then if anyone wants to go right, they go into the right. No, it's not working. Let's just keep it like that. There's just too- yeah, there's too many people cutting them off, so they're having a hard time taking that right. That's the problem. Too much going on. I think this is actually the culprit right here. That's the problem. So they get in the right lane, and they're trying to take a left, and then these guys in this lane are trying to take a right, so they can go right, see if you have competing, uh, competing traffic. I'll look at that later. Um, yeah, poor design. I need to, like, look up some Highway blueprints or something. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. You can see we have a ton of dead people, but we're going to continue this. I'm getting so close to having this damn full. Pretty dope.
see that it's starting to build up. And uh, yeah, lots to do. Thank you for watching.